Hey guys! Come in, Emmett. We, we have, have a special, special guest. Channel. We have a special guest, Emmett. And then today we're going to be watching a Dermot video. Okay. It's actually, she's not strolling. Okay. We just had the screen. Um, <laughs> Those clothes make you look really fat. What? What? That's so mean. How? Dude, that's like me. So. Wow, your wrinkles are really bad. You should use some cover-up to hide those age spots. No, get away, get away. No, we don't that. Go! You're really gonna eat good. all of that? Oh, I was planning to. Like what happened to you? You used to be so beautiful, then you gained all this weight. It's gross. Hey, stop yelling. <sighs> it turned blue. What does what that mean? It, it means we're having a baby. <laughs> Just like we've always talked about. No, I never talked about wanting a baby. Of course you did. No, I didn't. I'm not ready to have a baby right now. Okay, stop saying I know it's scary, but you're gonna be a great father. You need to get rid of it. What? How? We are not having that baby. I am not getting rid of it. How? What are you doing? Are you I can't do this anymore. Stupid. What does that mean? It means I'm leaving, Molly. I've been trying to pretend that things are good with us for a while now, but they're not. And adding a baby to the mix just makes things worse. You can't leave. You can't leave. Our baby needs a father. I need you. Then I guess you better find a new father. Because it won't be me. She didn't even pause. She just yes, I did. I did. I'm watching a video of her watching it. And Victor leaves his family it. behind to start a new life. He started dating a younger woman and began going out more and more. But the more time he spent whining and dining his new young girlfriend, the more his performance at work suffered. And he eventually lost his job. Being unemployed and broke meant Victor could no longer afford the fancy nights out with his new girlfriend. Which meant soon he had no girlfriend at all. Then one day, he runs into someone he hadn't seen in a long time. Oh, that's her. Molly? Molly, is that Stop really you? I am Victor? I can see. Wow, you look amazing. Stunning, actually. Wish I could say the same. You noticed. Yeah, well, it's been a tough year since we split up. You mean since you left me? <laughs> Look, like so we can do. I lost my job and lost my apartment, but things are gonna turn around for me any day now. Are you living in your car? It's only temporary. Well, it was nice seeing you, Victor. Wait, Molly. I can't hear. I've been doing a lot of thinking lately, and I realized that I made a big mistake walking out on you. And us meeting like this, I mean, it's a sign. I want to give this another shot. This? What is this? Us. You and I. The happy couple. Oh, Victor, it is too late for that. No, it's never too late, as long as two people really love Is everything okay, Molly? Yes, everything is fine. Honey, could you put the baby in the car seat? I'll be right there. 
No problem, honey. Well, I don't know. <laughs> ah, I see. You had to go marry some rich guy. Actually, that's not at all what happened. I'm the breadwinner in this relationship. You see, at first, we're poor. Uh, so I blamed myself well, for what happened rich. to our relationship. I spent countless hours playing the what if game. What if I had lost weight? What if I had worn the clothes you preferred? What if I did my makeup the way you wanted? I was so determined to blame myself that I couldn't see the truth. Not until a man appreciated me for who I truly am. We don't have Laws school. and all. The truth? That I wasn't the problem in this relationship, Victor. You were. You spent so much time tearing me down, making me feel bad about myself, and very little time building me up, supporting me, loving me unconditionally. And despite everything you did to me, let's pause because he's being too loud. I have to thank you for what? For giving me the most beautiful daughter whom I adore and for showing me the kind of man I do not want in either of our lives. Look, does it work? Let's pause it. Does it work? Wait. At least let me meet my daughter. You owe me that much. A baby needs her father. You're the one who said that. I don't owe you anything, Victor. And besides, my daughter already has a wonderful father. It's just not you. <laughs> yeah, freak you guys. <laughs> hey guys. Grace and Look what just came in. <laughs> it's the new Nike Dior's. It's the only so pair we have. On. And the commission on them is insane. Hey wow, guys, these look that's really the video. I hope you guys have an amazing time. And please like and subscribe. Like and subscribe! Bye!